Hey ladies and gentlemen, thanks a lot for your positive feedback. This instructional video is going to discuss the correction of your RPM gauge on older GM vehicles. Uh, it's prior to 2000, 2001, before 2001. When you LS swap your older GM vehicle, um, you may or may not notice a fluctuation or uh, that the RPM gauge is not right. And this is how you fix it. This car is a 98 Chevy Corvette and how we're gonna fix it is using this resistor it's a 1000 ohm resistor got this data from lt1swap.com shout out to Brendan he's awesome check his stuff out um, he does services and whatnot great guy Anyway, this is the resistor that we got to plug in the signal that comes from your ECM computer into your RPM gauge. And you're going to just simply put the two wires on each end of this resistor. So we're just going to casually go over here to where... Now, oh, okay, this is this, this computer is the Holly... Pre, is it Dominator? I believe it's the Dominator. So your tact signal is blue with the white line. Uh, uh, Hopefully you guys see it right. Blue with white line real quick. So we're gonna hook up this resistor between the signal and the wire to your uh, dash, dash. So yeah, we're gonna hook this up and it should fix the problem. Thank you. Goodbye.